Alright guys, we're going to go ahead and review one of the best uninstaller programs available right now and it's called Revo Uninstaller. Now I have made a review on Revo Uninstaller before, but this time we're going to make a review on Uninstaller Pro, the professional edition. We did a review on the free version, but the professional edition is a lot better. And MSRPs for $39.25 and let's see what PC Mag has to say about it. It says it's fully compatible with 64-bit apps, which is good. It removes leftover program bits. That's what I like Revo because it removes everything about the program. It, anything that's left over, it still, uh, it still deletes it. Permanently removes deleted files in the recycle bin. Real-time software monitoring. Many system it has system cleaning tools. And lets users execute command line uninstalls. The cons about it, though, is that it's expensive. Premium features are available in competing free apps. So in the free version, you can still use most of the stuff you can use on the Pro Edition. It doesn't remove browser toolbars or plugins. See, that's one thing I didn't like about Revo. That's true. It does not delete those toolbars or plugins. And the bottom line is that it offers more software removal features than its free version, but it's rel relatively high price and may keep some people away. And that's true. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at it. This is what Revo Uninstaller Pro looks like. What's cool about it is it shows you the new programs that have been installed and the, and the old ones down here. And that makes it a lot easier if you're trying to find a new program that you installed, which I did. I'm gonna go ahead and try to uninstall Panda Cloud Cleaner right here. I'm gonna click on it and then I'm gonna click on uninstall. First what it does is it creates a full registry backup. Now it's creating a restore point. So it even takes the appropriate measures to make sure your computer is backed up before it uninstalls anything. That's what it's doing right now. Now it's analyzing the built-in in uninstaller. And now we start the uninstall. It's uninstalling right now. Uninstalled successfully. And now what you do after that is you scan. And it's going to scan for any remnants left of the program. I'm scanning right now. Hope this doesn't take too long. Bam, and there we are. Now it's, good, now it's showing us everything that's left from the program. I'm just going to go ahead and select all. and click on delete so I just deleted every little detail about that program alright that's completely gone from my system I'm gonna click finish and that's it it completely uninstalled everything from it now this program works perfectly for uninstalling those programs or those malicious programs that just keep coming back somehow you can use Revo for that now let's go ahead and take a look at the tools that it has. It's got a junk. It's got an auto runner, auto auto run manager. So from here you can add what programs you want to auto run when you first turn on your computer. It's junk files cleaner, and that's cool. It actually puts them in a in a tab view that's that's badass I like that you can view all of these in tabbed view so let's go ahead and click on junk file cleaner let's take a look at it let's click on scan bam and there we are junk files and now let's click on delete and all junk files now are deleted so it has some cool tools Windows tools. Here we, we get a, a list of all the Windows tools we can use. For example, System Restore, Security Center, uh, Disk Defragmenter, etc. It also has Browser Cleaner, where we can clean cookies, temporary internet files, history. So we can clean all that out, which I'm not going to do because I have a lot of things I don't want to clean out. Because if I do, then I'll lose them but that's cool it also has a browser cleaner Microsoft Office cleaner 
I don't think that's a really good idea to clear out recent documents because you might have a document and you still want to keep. But you can do that if you want. It has that tool. It's got a Windows cleaner also where you can clean out, start menu, run history, and lots more. Evidence remover, I have no clue what that's for. I'm not going to execute that because I no, don't know for sure what that is. If you do know how that works, go ahead and comment on the comment section of the video, but I do not want to run that just in case. It might do something I don't, I won't like. Unrecoverable delete. List of files and folders which will be deleted and will be made impossible to recover. So this is like a file shredder tool if you want to delete some files permanently. There's a backup manager. A backup was created from when we uh, did the Panda Cloud Cleaner uninstall. It was just showing us the backups there. And you can restore to that backup by clicking on restore. And last but not least, we have options where we can go in there and change options on Revo Uninstaller Pro. All right, guys, that's about it. So Revo Uninstaller Pro has all those extra tools that I just showed you. But the free Revo Uninstaller does the same exact thing when it comes to uninstalling programs. So the free one could do everything that I did when I uninstalled. So all you're pretty much paying for are the tools to do all this and I, and to, to, to be honest with you there's free tools to do this type of stuff like CCleaner which is this program right here CCleaner will do all what these tools do for free alright except for the file shredder the unrecoverable delete but that's about it so check that out I gotta give Revo uh, Revo Uninstaller, I give it a good review, but the Revo Uninstaller Pro, this one that we just reviewed, I don't know. I don't know about it. I mean, it is expensive for what you get for just those tools, so I don't give it a good review, the Pro Edition, because it's, they're basically just charging you for extra little features that you can get for free with other programs. So just because of that, uh, I'm not giving it a really good review, but Revo Uninstaller for uninstalling software use the free edition and it works perfectly for the uninstalling function I give it a good review for the tools that it uses and the price I don't really I don't really recommend the pro version alright guys I will post a link on the description of the video for the free trial so you can try it out yourself if you're thinking of purchasing it alright guys thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe I'm always uh, uploading new software reviews again thanks for watching and have a good rest of your day